My friends, welcome back to EU4. We are playing as Cologne, and yes, we're just waiting for a second here. We're drilling the armies, uh, which might or not might not be a good idea. Um, we'll see. We are looking. Utrecht is com going to be completely out of troops very shortly. Um, there were Utrecht troops going towards um, its own region, so there's definitely going to be a fight, and Munster will lose his troops. But, Augsburg is losing so many troops. Oh, he's out. Yeah, they... Wait a minute. They got Augsburg out? What happened? Were you siege down? Were you siege down? Um, devastation. Oh, wow. Oh, well, Munchi, there's no way. Yeah, you're going to be annihilated, buddy. You are going to get annihilated. Your pal is out. And I think they're going to be building troops. Let us uh, recall our diplomat from B Bomifia. He's still on the trade lake. Friesland. Cleves would be willing to join on favors. Uh, but we need Brandenburg actually to deal with Pomemia. And me maybe even more. Now we can deal with him, like, right away. We just have to build up. But the other guy is, uh, is quite quite a bit of a problem. Also, how many troops does Frisland have? So, Frisland is having a force limit of 8, and they are currently having 7k troops. So, technically, they would be weaker. We do want to change this. We would like... I still like to get mercenaries. Uh, so we can actually dissolve them once we need them. We don't have more force limit. Uh, for now, there is little we are going to do. Cleves troops are readying themselves. Um, you could go to anyone else. You're not going against me. How are you doing? Let's pause here for a second. So, we have a 5-3 at the moment. Oh, that's very low on admin. Let's see who we're going to be selecting, since uh, we do have some issues here. As you can see, this is going to be a horrible, horrible thing. Uh, prestige will go up, devotion going down. Clarity would go down by 50. We can make a generous donation, bringing them up to 60. And lowering them back to 45. We'll get a noble. And we gain 10 prestige. Uh, Cleve's opinion of Cologne is changed by 50. Is that necessary? Unlawful territory? Sure, but I don't really feel the need to do the foreigner's noble. How about the merchant's son? We gain money, lose devotion. The clerisy is still pissed. The money we could use to get ourselves a building. We could also get a talented theologian. Clarity by 15, Burgess down, Devotion, I don't think so. Clarity by 15, Nobles down, Devotion by 10, no, we don't need more Devotion. Papal influence, like I said, this is just pissing off too many. So, we're going with the local Noble, uh, hopefully it's not too bad here on the points. Let's wait for the next tick. Oh man, it's still too, this is, this is, this is really bad. It's really bad. This this growth is is definitely something I would like to cry about. Uh, but what can we do about it, huh? Nothing. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Let's make sure the uh, these guys are just not pissed off anymore. Let us lose fifteen ducats. Build them up. We're almost at one. Construction cost plus fifteen. Oh god. Just do something about this, man. In 71, we can change this it's such a long ass time. Stability cost modifier. National unrest would be very nice. We can't deal with it yet. Um, Munster is still winning the war. Seriously, you're going to take out East Frisia. You do care of the troops of Utrecht. And these guys are growing like there's nothing else in the world that they want to do. This is dangerous though. This would be dangerous. 
the truce with Munch has ended, and this, this might be the, the perfect time. This might be the perfect time to go to war with Munster. We have a free diplomat. If we were going in, taking Mappen, we could ask Gelra to join us. That would probably be enough to deal with Munster. And uh, we're going to be showing strength or doing the rivalry thing, the humiliate rival, so we can start building up over here. At least some more. Presence on two continents. Yeah, we need colonists for that. Control center of trades. Five. Yeah, well, that, that's not going to happen. Discover America can only happen when we have a coastal region. <sighs> Before they built up too much. I probably am not able to get into their territory. Um, but we could lay waste to theirs. Utrecht. Could build up. And war monster. Cleves, because we're not bringing him in on the promise of territory, would not take any of his claims, even though he would like to. I want to keep this guy tiny but happy. Tiny but happy seems like a very good decision for me, and we can have people then pay. How much money do you actually have? Can we see that somewhere? Prestige is down, stability is up. There is a crap ton of corruption. I think they did not pay off their loans. Like this, the boom. That's why. That's probably how they got their additional money. Uh, we're on our army maintenance, so all we have to do is just stop drilling. Let's stop drilling, and we'll take care of the others. What is this? All range. Provinces in Cologne get a negative two for three years. Gain a skill plus one and national manpower guy. Ah, oh, damn it. How bad? Okay, not that bad. Let's wait until the monthly tick. Truce with Algenberg's up. It's still on three on three five. Yeah, it's okay. And they are getting pushed out. That's what we want to see. We need that army to go very low. Let's see what he will do. He cannot get into my territory. And let him have this fight. Once he has no troops, it is very, very easy to declare this war. We might not even need an ally. He has the one guy will join, but hey, it's, it's barely anything. We can just humiliate him and not call him in. He almost lost all of his troops. Let's wait until we have full morale though. He is now in my territory. Let's see what will happen. Um, Utrecht's going in. Now we need to make sure they don't take everything. If they do this, this has no point. This has no value. What will you do? Will you go in and fight? Will you both go in and fight? Please go both in. Yeah, he will win. He will win. Precisely what I was hoping that would happen. He will go unoccupy this, and we're going. We're going to be smashing his armies to pieces. How many? How many uh, troops do you still have? Like, yeah, not so much. Your total is four one. Yeah, we know that's a lie. Although, is it? I don't think so. He, they were almost at full full uh, morale. One more tick, I guess. Next month, it's happening. Yeah, I think this is more than enough to go deal with uh, Munster. Let's declare war. We don't need any more territory at the moment. We don't need our allies. That's even better. Let's go in. What will he do? Let's go and sit right on his capital. His ally didn't join because he was forced to break that relations. And Utrecht is going to annihilate his army over here. He will have nothing. We are taking control of his capital. That's what we need for the um, humiliation. There's no need to do anything else. Just sit on top 
of this will not take territory. They have no no need for this at all. And this is already siege down. We might have to wait until it, it goes back. Or perhaps getting the capital is more than enough. They won't like it because we're going to rob him. We're going to be robbing him blind. Oh yeah, looking very much forward to this. And they're just clearing this out. They don't feel the need to help me. They don't need to help me. 0%. Archbishop, some news. Austria decided to accept the offer of knowledge sharing from Hungary. So Hungary and Austria are going to be friendlies. Um, we are at war, so we're still negative 70. Cologne, my army strength definitely is a problem for Austria. Getting in peace deal with Austria would be so nice. We could storm here at the cost of 5, but we don't want to. Mm, 14%. Come on, I would like to see this one just surrender. 28 and we haven't lost any troops. Yeah, we're reinforcing. That is true. Army maintenance, fort maintenance. Uh, we don't need fort maintenance. Let's drop that. And that would definitely generate more income. And this, this is about to fall. Negative two, apparently. Because they consider the uh, maintenance uh, of the fort... To be in the war score. I don't think this will happen. It will take long. But what will these guys do? How would that go? I'm not sure. But hopefully we can still humiliate him. I'm actually hoping they would piece him out. Uh, so we can take Mappen. I don't think that is going to happen though. So 50% chance guys. 50. There you go. We're 80% in our war score. And now if we were to sue for peace. And... We could show strength, gain 100 of each monarch point. Actually, do I want to have that more than anything else? Uh, humiliate, war rappers. Um, I don't care for this. Annul treaties, end rivalry. No, just annul your treaty with Hungary or with Holland and give me your money. And uh, we can just wait here for some more because we can just sit on this capital for... How much more do can we get? Yeah, it's growing up by another 24 points. So by the time we take this, it's going to be nice. We don't need this. Uh, wow. Papal loyalty even going down. Losing prestige or gaining papal influence and loyalty from the papals. Uh, can we do anything to change that? We can do that uh, at the cost of 10 prestige. And this will cost me 15. So let's do that and do it like this. So now what we can do is uh, once this is it's completely sacked. We don't need this over here. We don't need to have full army maintenance. There's, there's little they can do. So let's just drop this down. Yeah, low maintenance. Oh, no shit. Oh, I did that myself, game. Thank you. Oh, my humiliation, though. Getting a hundred of each monarch point. Oh, that's sweet. Because if this, this war goes, and it, that will take a long ass time since they don't have the capital. Hmm. Steering trade. This guy is going to be a one province. He will no longer be a valid rival. After the war they are having right now. So getting a hundred. I think is the best decision. Uh, national ideas. Yeah we're going to be waiting. Waiting a tiny bit. Since we're, we're gaining so little. We have to be very conservative about this. We can just get, we're just gaining two. I hate it. We might have to take an advisor here. Yeah, I think we have to. We have to take an advisor to boost up this. But it will just boost up by one, doesn't it? It will gain one. And we would most likely go... Um, stability cost modifier. So it would cost less, I guess, to get in more stability. 
Uh, inflation? Yeah, we're not inflated that much. We can raise war tax, but we don't really want to. Um, what else? Who's the other guy? And we definitely want to get a point more. Every point is better. Uh, probably the national unrest. But 1.9 per month is not good. It will be offset once we start, you know, developing and building those buildings. Uh, but till then, yeah, what can we do, you know? Uh, there's no need to keep this um, one diplomat around now. So let's go um, have him around going my allies. And we'll just wait until the war score here goes up. Yeah, it's a shame that this is actually lower, lowering. Such a shame. Will that be the same over here? Is this going down? 173. Let's wait till next tick. It doesn't appear to be so. So, once we start drilling again, I think that would be a good idea. Now, we are going to be waiting. How... Um, let's see. How is this going? Oh, look at that. Uh, Breda has it. Uh, so it will go to probably Cleves or Gelra. And from Gelra it could spread towards me. They have been developing, haven't they? 16, 19. Uh, we have embraced the Renaissance speeding up the... Okay, that's Austria. Would that benefit me as well? No, 0 0.7 doesn't benefit us also, uh, at all. Uh, construction cost is something that could go down as well, but... Yeah, let's get an advisor here and let's go with the national unrest. Call to arms to join the wars in Cleves and Saxony. Oh god, what happened? Cleves, are you are you going to war? Oh, we can call them to war. <laughs> no, that's not happening. Uh, this is just going to be ticking on very shortly and nicely. Let's get ourselves the uh, national unrest kind of guy. So we get at least one more point. We have a national decision active. Missionary strength plus five. Institution spread negative five. Uh, no. No. No, no. This, this, this... Let's turn it off. Let's not. Since we do want to have the inter in institution spread. And we're at 9-5. When, uh, when will you be okay with this deal? And you are going to give me those monarch points. I don't demand anything else. As long as you're my, uh, my rival. I just need that. And then the war with Friesland is going to be a very, very viable thing. Let's take a look here. Unlawful territory. So that's still 12. And but we're losing it now by 1.1. So in 10 years time, I would have lost, uh, I will lose 11. So that would be uh, roughly like 11 years or 10 years until it's died out. Which is not too bad. Okay, what the hell is this? Uh, lose devotion, which we absolutely don't care about. Or lose prestige. I value my prestige a lot, though. Did we just lose monies? Yes, we did. Oh, yeah, of course, we hired that advisor to gain more. Uh, we could go with the military technology. I think that is important. I want to be quite... Far in there. Um, the offensive morale. I would like to go with shock. Shock is amazing. Offensive. Yeah, let's go with the infantry. As for the Latin and Knights. Yeah, there's no change. Um, this will go probably next time. Yeah, and military tech 10. So we won't be changing that. We got better infantry right now. So I think we're in military tech. We're on 5. They are on 4. And I'm okay with that. So we'll wait until this war is done. 
We're not losing anything, and, and they are just completely occupied by me. So, we might as well just speed up for a second here. National ideas. Production efficiency by two. That would generate us more money. Neighboring bonus. Ah, the Renaissance is a thing, though. I would really like this to change, and... As soon as we can buy it, we will. Hopefully we'll get it soon. The spread here is now quite nice. Uh, not for us, but once Galra has it, uh, we will. There we go, the war is done, let's pull you back. Um, actually, not you, well, now that you're going back, uh, we might as well. And uh, Let's piece him out. And we still have this on 9-5 though. A uh, humiliate. Yeah. Probably going to be the show strength. But we'll have to uh, clear this out. Show strength because he is not going to be a valid rival. And. Yeah it's actually. Um, Monsha will lose 20 prestige. Show strength though. Now uh, we do need to develop at some point. Let's set the demands. Let's exit. Accept that. There we go. We get uh, 10 in everything. We get a plus 30 on power projection. That is sweet. Uh, but we lost the rivalry, I guess. And who uh, do we lose alliances? I don't think so. So we don't have to deal with that. Uh, Mappen, he might be... Getting a message from the Emperor saying, yeah, you're a very, very bad man. Um, monies or admin? Uh, since we're very low on the admin, let's do the admin. Let's save out as much as possible. Overending rogues. How is Friesland doing? If we were to declare right, right now, we could uh, call into arms all. Everyone. Isn't that gorgeous? How is this doing? Army maintenance. We're actually losing money here. Due to that damn, damn guy. But, yeah. Next time, guys. A war with Friesland. And we, um, we might have to change our... We've lost the Causes Belly against Utrecht. We've gained a Causes Belly against Munster. And they had to take it back. There you see? They were forced to return this, most likely, uh, by Austria. So, yep, yeah, I'm very happy that we did not take anything else. Um, by now, we are the only guy... Everyone's in favor of Saxony. And we'll probably cast a vote for Sax... You know, Saxony, he is our ally. <laughs> How fun would that be if our ally would be, you know, a friend? So we're going to go for for Saxony. If I can find him. There we go. Saxony. Saxony, Saxony and Saxony. Three of the electors are voting for Saxony. Um, he's probably going to be the next emperor. Hopefully he will love me and he has an alliance with me. So we could possibly get away by getting more territory if, if, well he's a big ass if, he actually becomes the emperor. Let us focus on our next war. In the next episode we are going to be declaring, we're going to be asking Brandenburg to go in. Do you have some weird ass alliances? Like vassals? No. Palmeria. Let's turn this off. So we can actually just go in right away next time. A uh, total of 6k troops. Brandenburg should be able to deal with that. And... Who else would join? Oldenburg. Mm, shall we ask to... Let's ask in Cleves. 
so we keep Saxony and, and Trier. So we can actually go against someone else. We, we, we're probably not going to take territory, guys. Uh, since the uh, unlawful territory here. Oh yeah, they don't like that. They don't like we changed vote. Ah, that's bad. Yeah, we will net. We will that. That's for sure. We won't take territory in the next war. Uh, humiliation and taking money and development is what we will be doing. For now, thank you for watching, and I hope to see you next time. Have a good one. Bye, bye.